Thousands of students, hundreds of teachers and lots of big bangs. That's what makes the Big Bang Fair South East a fantastic science show. Our STEM Fest has been absolutely fantastic. Uh, we started uh, four years ago as the main sponsor for STEM Fest and I think it's grown from 1,800 people attended the first one to 7,500 people that have now attended. That container, our cardboard tube, is going to rupture that the fragments coming off are going to be travelling faster than the speed of sound. Three, two, one. Science, technology, engineering and maths. The STEM subjects brought to life. We brought our most enthusiastic scientists from year five and six um, and they're having a lovely day, they're trying all sorts of things, some of the things they can't necessarily do in school. So it's having that and starting to come so to see the thinking about being a scientist when they're older, an engineer, mathematician, all those sorts of things. Drawing with sand using a modified bicycle. Learn to draw your outline scaled down ten times or make a chair out of paper strong enough for two. It's just amazing how it's out of newspaper, something you can find at home and just is so strong to hold me and Max. So yeah, it's, it's inspiring. It's just paper, that's all. So I was, I was a bit nervous. What the Big Bang Fair does is really put their school subjects into context. So the science and the maths that they learn at school is really put into context for them by meeting some of the great um, engineering and science employers that are at the fair. Events like this over the four years has made us as a company been able to connect with over 22,000 students, 1,000 plus teachers and in the region of about 450 schools. We would not have been able to have done this without STEM Fest and the Big Bang South East. It's also encouraged those students from an early age now to con consider the careers in the industry, which is benefiting the country as a whole. For anyone who wants to be in the circuit, I'd like to link hands and make a circle, right, to complete the circuit, switch on his nose. There's also a bit of competition for research and experiments. When it did fly, we observed that the skirt, as you can see here, is a little bit too shallow, so it wasn't really capturing the air as well as we thought it would. So it's not as well built as we thought it would be, but we've learnt from our mistakes and wish to hopefully build something bigger and better in the future. The depth of knowledge they acquire for their particular interest is, is fascinating and, and a lot of the time they're doing the work off their own backs as well so they are helped and assisted by their schools but they've taken the idea and run with it so you can tell just how enthusiastic they are. Young minds working as teams encouraging science for everyone. Children with special needs are able to come and be a part of it and enjoy it and take part and gain something from it. So that's why we like it. If I get it just right. Woo! Bringing science to life for those young people who want to go on to spend their life in science. <laughs>